We are going to talk about mm. what it seems like everybody is talking about, the yeah. death of Matthew Perry at 54 years old. This was the best time of his adult life in the last three or four weeks. This is what we're being told by people who have had daily contact uh, with Matthew Perry, that he was as optimistic and as healthy, at least on the surface, yeah. um, as he had been in many, many years. And I gotta tell you, I mean, a lot of people are saying, well, could this have been a relapse and everything else? I don't believe, look, we weren't there, but I do not believe so. Everything we know says that's not the case. And I wanna just tell you a little bit about, you know, how we broke the story. That um, one of our producers, actually, actually. Charlie, who is yeah. here, um, uh, she got the uh, initial tip. And I called somebody who was very, very close uh, to Matthew Perry, one of the people who worked for him, um, who had daily contact. And um, she was, when I, when I told her, look, we've gotten this tip, I'm not saying it's so, um, but we've gotten this tip, her first reaction was, that's impossible, that's ridiculous. Right. And it, it, I remember hanging up the phone thinking, whatever this may or may not be, um, I don't believe it had anything to do with him relapsing because she, she was, was so confident. Right, and she was probably looking at it as that it's a possible overdose or something. And that's why she said it couldn't be because from what they knew, it was, that's not what his life he was He was in right. such a good place. And I even talked to her again today and told her this. And she said, that's exactly right. She said when I, she, she left a message for him on his phone after I called her um, and she was just convinced yeah. given his state of mind, given everything she saw about him, this was not a relapse, and I, I absolutely do not believe it was a relapse.